Today I'm going to show you how to use SB Clone, our Superbase project cloner. All right, so let's take a look at how you can easily clone your Superbase project using SB Clone. We're starting here with our empty test project SB Connect test, which as you can see has no tables and no data. So the first thing you're going to do is click the Start New Clone button, and then you're going to enter your access token from Superbase and click Next. From here, you'll choose your source project, which you wish to copy, and then your destination project, in our case, the SB Connect test. After that, enter your passwords for your source and destination database and click Next. Now choose the data you wanna copy over and then insert your project source keys. Now you're going to run the table definitions query. This will return all the tables that will be transferred over when you clone your project. As you can see, if you scroll down here, it shows the amount of tables and columns that will be transferred over. Then click continue to review. And from here, you'll see the clone process start. As you can see, the clone process is starting. And if we look at the rest of the screen, the real-time data transfer is occurring. And we'll scroll all the way down. And you can see this is completed. And then we'll go through the clone steps. There's still some processes that have to run. But if you go back up, everything is complete. Now, if you go up to the dashboard and go to clone history, you'll see that your project's clone has completed. Now, when we return to our target project in Superbase, you'll see that the tables, data, and RLS policies have been copied over. SB Clone makes it really easy to copy your Superbase projects into new projects. Whenever you're ready, just go ahead and click sign up and give it a try.